it the bevel the cutting bevel is on one side of the blade so the other blade is flat you know um, and like when you're looking at the rafters inside there you see the flat sections on them that was done by Like you would you'd, you'd draw a line up the back of it, you'd notch in See, so where you want to you can create whatever you need for your joint. You need a flat on this side. Come the same. Let me turn that thing over. But suddenly you're getting what you need to mm. do a joint across there. You're squaring it down just where you need it. You know, you're not like if you wanted a completely straight piece of timber that requires a lot of, lot of modern carpentry, requires everything to be straight, absolutely straight to begin with. But that involves a hell of a lot of waste when you're actually dealing with the tree, the tree coming in. You can lose up to, uh, you know, 20, 30, 40 percent of what you bring in, simply straightening stuff, you know. Um, we see that in the sawmills with all the, the scrap that they end yeah, up. Yeah, but here, here they were simply taking from what was in the hedgerow, in the wood, yeah. and they'd work it.